Hey there, welcome back to Let's Play Dungeon Master. Um, I looked it up and God bless the devs. Um, what we are missing, I will show you what we're missing so that we can all bask in the, the trolliness of the devs of this game. I don't know exactly where it is, but I know roughly where I am looking. So this is the wall. It should be about here. That's what I've overlooked. A white key on a white stone ground all that time. But now we know where we have to go. Oh, you are so boned. Ha! Suck it. I mean, now that he's gone, let us explore further. And I may, for this episode, have a map open next to me. Mostly just so I knew where I was looking for that key. Uh, come on, die. That said, I'm not getting much out of it anymore. In fact, I just closed it. Damn it, I should have looked up what this wall does. Oh, well. I'm sure it will... Maybe a dart? No? Arrow, perhaps? No. I don't know what that's supposed to do. Anyway, we're going to continue snaking around until we find that locked door. Here we go. And we now have the right key for it. So that's an occasion worthy of a save. Huzzah! Really? Yeah, you just keep on skelly. Oh, I see what he's doing. That was a slightly more powerful fireball than I intended, but it got the job done, I suppose. Okay. No one leaves here alive. Except me. I kind of have to. Um, nothing else around there. Ouch. We're hurting. That was an effective healing potion. I see a chest. With a potion of defense. Uh, we'll put that in there. The spell Yarbro leaves a trail of yeah, sorry Yarbro rods leaves a trail of magical footprints. I suppose if I ever had to retrace my steps, that would mean something. But it's not something I've really had to do with any. I wonder what that is. Had any difficulty with before? Ooh, an alternate stairway. And then back there. Right. Well. Um, we're going to illuminate our situation. We're going to save. And now we're going down this stairway. Down two... St Holy crap. Three... The only other way out is another way in. So the only way out is another way in. Right. Four. Five. <coughs> six. Holy crap. That just took us to the bottom of the dungeon. I wonder... Do we have anything that looks like it might possibly be useful there? No. Holy crap. Hmm. I don't suppose oh, I'm going to waste too much time on that. Um, I'm going to be in indifferent to spoilers in comments. 
um, but I'm not going to waste any more time investigating that for now. I am sure when I see a key that reminds me of that, I'm going to know to come back and check it out. Oops, there's a wall there. Um, oh, I see the problem, just a moment. Um, up my CPU cycles a bit will help. It's not the, the cure. I still have issues sometimes, but it does help alleviate the symptom. Lightning bolt, Okathra. Uh, I'm going to hang on to you for a pressure plate. That was it. No more keys on the ground. For controlling game. Just a moment. Just repositioned the the box in, or oh, sorry, the window in the middle of my screen. Um, this is a lot of nothing. When is rock not rock? When it isn't. <coughs> Um, I don't know, when it rolls? <coughs> ah! Well then obviously the direction left had something to do with that. Maybe when there's nothing left, perhaps? Next time our light goes out, I need to remember... Oh, Jesus. Holy shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That is a rust monster. We will not hesitate to use our fold bomb on him. Jesus, uh... Okay. I think they have to hit us to dissolve our weapons, but I don't want to find out. And I think maybe that was the, the monster that um, Ghost Del Peace was hinting at. You know, the, I can't believe they didn't get sued over that one, or someone didn't get sued by someone else over that one. Because, um, yeah, it does kind of resemble a rust monster. Now, having survived an encounter with one of those, we're saving. Now, where's our next fall bomb? Do that. <gasps> it's a burrow. I know you guys from Stalker. Food. Naturally, we're going to give some to Wuff. He, oh, he must have been the one that ate that other one. Okay, well, ignore me. Now, when our light runs down a bit more, we're going to try out the Illumulate. The Illumet, or whatever the hell it's called. What's it called? Illumulet. Right, obvious switch is obvious. What it does is less so. I have an apple. Oh, it looks like Sira's in line for that. And a torch. And nothing we can do with that. Nothing there. So it's a push once only button. No more keys on the ground, no. Um, no key there. We've got a magic box. Uh, where can that go? Oh, there was a spot there. Now, hisses. Not doing too well. Pendant feral. Is that cursed? No. Um, look, hisser, you've just got the choker for the moment. So, where, where are we? No. Look, let's free up some inventory. 
Thirty-five, forty-three, fifty-six. It weighs point two kilograms and seems to do very little. But we'll see if that maybe ups his damage, perhaps. I don't know. Hang on to the choker for pressure plates. And I hear a thing. What can I hear and where is it? Hmm. What have we got back here? <coughs> back here. Holy crap. It's kind of cute and kind of cuddly and kind of not all at the same time. It's Joey's Ratatar. <coughs> and it just ate Sonya's face. Wow. But drumsticks. I hope they all do that. We could definitely get used to that. Seems like quite a fair trade, really. Um, we're going to rest because people are hurting a bit. Let them get their health back up before we continue on and brave the other perils of the... I don't know, the pet shop. Oh, she can just drink that. Now, Syrah, weak fireball for you, because I didn't think to use a higher degree of power, because, I'm an idiot, blech, because I am an idiot who can't even word. So we've done that. Look. Um, Gem of Ages, what does that do? Sixty-two, fifty-two, thirty-nine. Nothing there. Fifty-two, forty, forty. Again, that doesn't seem to do anything. Um. Hang on to that. Now light is slowly running out. Finally, and we're back here. Hmm. So we've finished, we solved that riddle. If I'm overlooking pressure plates, by all means, let me know. It's always difficult in a game like this to be looking at every surface in every frame, but still keeping things moving at a reasonable pace. Certainly when they keep changing the, the pixel in which the switches are hiding, too. It doesn't make things any easier, for sure. Okay, well, let's try the Illumulate. Oh, it's a little, a little lighter. You know what? Why not? Um, this doesn't seem to do anything. I don't know what I'm going to hold on to it for. So we're going to swap that for that. And Waff, you can supplement the light with your own. Now, again, no idea where we're going. I only assume that this opened that and I just didn't notice it because I hadn't been around there yet. <coughs> Carrying on. Well, no. Lordy, I hope this isn't getting to a point in the game where I just have to sit here with the clue book in front of me the whole time. That wouldn't be fun for anybody. It would basically be, a, at that point, a, an illustrated audio book. As I read through the solution because I'm too inept to work it out for myself.
but my options seem to be disappearing rather quickly. <coughs> yep, just bump your heads into the wall, guys. That's pretty much how I'm feeling at the moment. Um... Hmm. <coughs> yep, walk into the wall again because you're stupid. Hmm. Um, hmm. I'm going to give it five more minutes, and if I have made no more progress, I'm going to call it there. So look ahead, and if this episode's only 20 minutes long, you'll have your answer. You can skip to the next episode with no real repercussions. Nothing along there. Don't need to use that coat hook. Do we put something in there? Um... Nope. I am at an utter loss as to what we do next. <coughs> so you know what? Let's just cut the crap and I'll be right back. And I'm back and I'm an idiot. I didn't check my compass. Where are we? Um, Wuff, light please. Where are we? This should be along here. Yep, if you see. Yep, there. There was a spinner. No. 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 I'm going to remove the clues to my right hand side now and carry on. I am recording, I'm not muted. Um, and we're going to fill these back up. Something I do miss is the sustenance spell from Black Crypt. I did enjoy that. So yeah, all I needed to do was look at the compass that I have devoted to one of Sira's hands and I would have had my solution there. But no, I'm an idiot. So let's all just oh, get it out of the way now. Odd that there's a wall along there for completely nothing. But there you have it. And we got a door. Behind the door is a wall. Around the wall is more wall. Ah! And Joey's Ratata. Come on. Go on. Thank you. More grub. I am not going to be unhappy with that ever. We can get rid of that now. Actually, we can probably eat one. Give that to Hissa. Now, Sonya, you lost a limb there by the look of you. Let's heal up. Uh, there. And another. And another. Serum gone with this, folks. Any others? We have actually managed to use up all of our po all of our flasks for healing potions. I'm okay with that. Going to save. 
and back out. So, where are we going next? Um, hmm. More empty rooms. Oh, there's a button. We flipped the button. We open this. We have Storm Ring. Actually sounds pretty cool, but it doesn't look like we have a, a devoted jewelry slot. Or do we? I don't know. I will have to research what we do with jewelry. Choker can go. More grub. Who's going to eat that? Or she's going to eat that. Wait, I heard that. There's something coming up. Put that there, that there. Right, what's sneaking up on me? Sira, a decent fireball, please. Everyone else, walk into a wall. And a door. So I'm clearing out the area that's open before we unleash anything else upon ourselves. It seems for the time being that monsters aren't capable of you know, basic tasks such as opening doors for themselves. And... Oh! We will do this the old-fashioned way, I suppose. Well, How did that not get someone sued? That is a that is the spitting image of a rust monster. It was also a waste of time going down here. I assume though, I think I mentioned in the last episode or earlier this one, I forget. I, I expect the damage to be when they hit you as opposed to when we hit them. As opposed to those large black gelatinous things in either Beholder 3 that just suck your weapons up when you hit them. Apparently gelatinous cubes are meant to do that too, but I've never encountered that. Oh. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. So what we just did was drop all of that loot down. I'm willing to bet that's pretty much what the game had intended for us. And now we have to find our way around there and drop down and fetch it. And you know what? That's what we're going to do. Hello birds. Whoa! Um, waff. Wow, okay, well. We're reloading. I shall be right back. Okay, and we're back. Now, all we had done, I think, was kill that rust monster. Am I about right with that? No, we still seem to have chokers. We don't have storm ring. Damn it, when did I last save? It makes me quite sad. Um, Carrying on, then. I think we've got to find our stuff. Oh, so that's... The way we came in, we're going to have another gulp. But now we know what's waiting for us on the other side of that. We also now know not to stuff around with that lever. So this is information that I'm not ungrateful to have. And but for that, um, I'm going to call them burrows. I don't know exactly what they're called, but I'm going to call them burrows because they remind me of the, the dwarves from the Stalker games. Um, but for them... Um, handing Sonya's ass to her, we probably would still be here. Sorry, we, we would have endured with you know, going down the, the hole for our stuff. Storm Ring. Although, looking at the situation, I think we might have to drop the, the pit, drop the, the loot in order to get it, because there's a pit in front of it. I suppose I'm naively holding on to hope that we won't have to do that because we will find a way of raising the other pit. Call me an optimist. Now let's just go and take care of that rust monster. <coughs> oh, there's the door. We know what's behind there. We're not going back there yet. 
we know that there is nothing there. And we know that there is something around here. Come on. At least they're slow. Thank God. So there's nothing else around here by the look of it. That was him. Oh, stairs up. What do we have around here then? Nothing. Oh, we have a button. Hello? Wow, 162. Good shot, Kissa. Oh. And we have a magical box again. The game seems to like giving us these. Don't think it's realised that I'm not using them for the moment. But, you know, I'm not ungrateful. The sling we can drop. Wooden shield, falchion, falchion. Wooden shield, wooden shield. Falchion, wooden shield, falchion. Apples, we're just going to go ahead and eat. And nothing there. Or there. And that's a pit. We're going to save and see where this pit goes. Aha! See, there was a way. My optimism paid out. Paid off. Um, we have a green gem which means we're going to have to do a bit of inventory management. Um, choker can go down. Wuff, green gem can go in your inventory when you've got a moment. Ah, what the hell, what the hell, what the hell? That opened. I didn't want that to open. Maybe we had to weigh this down or something. I don't know. Put the gem back. There you are. I don't know. We're going to take it with us, damn it. Fuck the police. What have we got here? A uh, potion of healing. Um, now she has a dagger that Wuff can, not Wuff, that Hissa can put in there. Do we have any other missiles that I should more appropriately have on my belt? No. I wonder if walking out of here causes a, an ambush. What is underfoot is soon overhead. Okay. So. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see. There are pressure plates on the floor. Holy crap. Okay, so, this seems like a good spot to leave it. We're going to... Not going to do that. We're going to sleep, and everyone's going to rest. And when we pick up next episode, we're going to probably stray fireballs for an hour or so until I get tired of life and move on to something else I'm sure um, so join me then saving our game I hope you've enjoyed yourselves this episode we are making progress we're chipping away at it slowly but surely um, so until next time cheers